Hey guys, Nintendo Caprice on here, and welcome back to Metroid Prime 3 Corruption. Um, in the last video, I don't remember. We were just finishing up some stuff. Anyway, I was looking over my pickups here, and 98 out of 100. So I was looking all over the map, like, okay, where are those last two pickups at? And uh, I found one of them here on Brio. It's actually... Let me back out for a second here. I think it's down here. It's in one of these temple areas. Oh, you, 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 where are you? Where are you, you sucker? You keep running, sucker! And you tell that realty company... Well, maybe it's here, actually. I think this may actually be it. This is it. It's right here. It's right here in the temple. So I'm not actually sure where that is, but... I think it was like one of the very first boss fights was there, but anyway, I'm just gonna go ahead and head over there now. But see, the thing is, I found that one and I couldn't find the other one. Now, I'll explain in a minute why I couldn't find the other one, but, but I was looking all online and everything, and people were saying, oh, it's probably on Valhalla. And then other people were saying, no, it's in, you know, Brio Ice. You know, the ice area of Brio, because that doesn't show up on the main map. So you can't really see it. But, um, I just went and checked the ice area, and there was, I already got everything there. I checked Valhalla, I already got everything there, too. At least judging by the pickups list I did. So I was like, where is that other pickup? And it was driving me crazy, and I didn't know. And eventually I figured it out. Like I said, I'll explain it when I get there. In the meantime, let's go to that temple. Let's go to the temple and pray to the Lord, dear Lord. Thank you for the opportunity to make these private tapes in solitude. And since this is the last night, please let it be a good and long one. Because I never know because it's very unpredictable when they're going to come back. So thank you, Lord. And help me to make the right sacrifices to pay for all this. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, anyway. Um, that's right, we got Phazon dusters all up in here. A lot of really rare, rather, 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 So I will be finishing the game in this play, in this recording session. Which is good, because once I'm done with that, I can move on to whatever I want to do next. Okay, so one thing I haven't brought up that I was, you know, the people have been asking me if I'm going to get back to it, is Mario Maker. Because I've been saying all this stuff about, oh, I'm going to do Super Mario Land, I'm going to do Secrets of Grindio, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. And I haven't made much mention of Mario Maker. Well, I think I probably will actually do some more of that. I'm not sure when, but there will be more. I will say that. Because that's something that's pretty easy to record. I can do it. Yeah, and I want to do it too. Like, actually, I've been watching people. Because the Beard Brothers are still doing it. And it's a good game. You know? I mean, there's, you know, a lot of potential for obstacles and shit and shit. So here we go. We haven't been down here in forever, man. It's been a long, long time. But there is a power-up here. And the last two power-ups are basically just missile packs. Because the max missiles is 255. And I have 245 now, and I have two pickups left to get. Which means the last two are missiles. Get out of my way, you mother truckers! I better be going the right way. I'm not even looking at the map, and I know I should be. Yeah, this is it. Okay, it's over here. It's over here. I don't see anything here yet, but... Yeah, you're dead. Wait a second, I see something over there. Looks like I can do something with the Nova Beam here? Man, who would have thought they put this out here? Okay, bleep bleep. Well, I'll just stop there and, dude, thank you. <laughs> oh my God, what is going on here? Can we get in here? Safer in here? Very right, well. This is definitely, <laughs> this is definitely not what I was expecting at all. I thought this was gonna be easy. I can't get like under. Ugh. I 
can't see the map now, so I don't know like where I am relative to it. Those things are so annoying. You know what? Hang on. Out you go. Doesn't matter, you're still gonna... Wait, is there like... Is this like a maze? Maybe I have to like work my way around? That's actually kind of cool. Huh. So that's how we get around. There it is. Wow. That was tricky. Man, I didn't expect to come into this room and be struggling like this. These nasty ass monsters, boy. Probably should have tried some ice missiles on them or something. So anyway... Well, I hope everybody's doing okay. You know what's surprising about this, actually, is that to part 44 of this, I recorded it before I went to Colin Bravo, but for whatever reason, I didn't upload it. So that's going to be a post Colin Bravo video, even though I recorded it before. So I have no idea what I said on that. It's basically the last half of the Valhalla tour. So, it was that. Anyway... So that'll be fun, and then after that, we'll be pretty much done with this game. I'll tell you what, man. Pretty anxious to see. I hear a lot of people say that the final boss is kind of hard. Hopefully the fact that I'm playing on normal difficulty will dilute that sensation somewhat. And uh, act as preparation H to the proverbial hemorrhoids of that experience. The hemorrhoids of that experience. Just a wonderful metaphor. I love a good toilet metaphor, though. And look at that, just like that, we're back in the ship. Easy schmeezy Japanesey. And see, I was checking over here and over here, and I thought these were places I couldn't land. Well, they are places I can't land, but you can still look at the map. Oh, well, okay, maybe you can't. Well, we get there from the command center, so let's just start there. But anyway, that's where it is. It's in one of those little grayed out areas. That's why I couldn't find it, because I wasn't looking at the map right. Or, like, I wasn't looking at the map from the right module, I guess, or something. Whatever. Well, say goodbye to Brio. I guess we're never going to see that planet again. It's too bad. I kind of liked it. I kind of liked Brio. Well, I liked all the planets in this game, really. I can save all my love for just one. Give my planets the preferential treatment here. Yeah, so we got some roast beast sitting on the stove. And I could be eating that right now, but I decided to record this video for you fine folks instead. So I hope you appreciate that. Let me see. Um, okay, so now we can zoom out and actually look at the planet. We can look at it over here. Here's where it is. I've never actually been in this room. That's a landing site? Oh, no wonder. Okay, and that goes to the command center. So basically all I gotta do is find the train station. Okay, well, now that we made it to the other side, we can finally explore, explore this more properly here. Explore, yeah, lovely. What even is this? Wait, is this that room, really? It was here? Yeah, seriously, I thought there would have been a way to get to that green door in the other room, but... Because that's how you get back into that room after you're done here. But for the life of me, I just couldn't figure out how to get out there. Anyway. So this is right around the point where... If I'm not mistaken... This should be right around whereabouts that landing pad is that I never discovered. It's right over here. Oh my god. And on the way there, speak of the devil. Turn the gears. And this will be... Would you learn to play this game? Oh my god, how did I know you were going to be in here? Now kill your babies. You suck me off and I kill your babies. I can't think of the more... Dude... I'm trying to switch my visor. Give me a break. You're out of it. Now. No, no, I'm trying to come out of the x-ray visor. I really hate that there's no other way to do that besides to point it exactly in the center of the screen and then change it, you know? 
I'm never pointing at the center of the screen. You know me. There we go. Complete the game to view this ending. Well, don't mind if I do. What is this? Nothing. Yeah, but apparently there was a landing spot right out here. Which really, if not for this upgrade, why else would I have needed this one? But, oh hell. Give me a reason to sift out the things here. Do you have anything different to say because I haven't done this yet? Yeah, sure. Don't mind if I, I mean, I just said that. Um, why don't I take care of these boobs in here first? These hot boobs. They melt each hot boob by licking the nipple and then rubbing it aggressively or gently or both. Oh, there's so much of it, dude. That's the other way to destroy a boob. Set off a bomb next to it. Why is there so much here? Why is there so much, man? Oh, well, there you go. It's a nice little landing pad. It's kind of out of the way, you know, and there's stuff here. And... Oh, man. Pray tell, what are you? What, you're bringing in more of that? I don't need more of that crap around me. Alright, right, whatever. Let's land this thing. Alright, so... To all that time just to get two upgrades. I can't believe that would make a whole video. But my recording time is just 37 minutes. It's like, jeez, man. Here comes the train station to be. To be or not to be. Um, if I'm not mistaken, this is the one. That will take us where we need to go. So, boo. Oh, man, it is. Oh, it totally is, man. Oh, my God, am I ready for this or am I not? I'm not. I mean, that's if you, if you want the truth for me right now. I'm so not ready for this. Mentally. I don't know, man. It's, uh, I shouldn't kid around, honestly. Like, I'm ready for this. I'm totally ready. Put in that code, Samus. Shake it up a little bit while you're at it. Shake up those numbers. Objective completed. Samus, we have gained control of the Leviathan. Yes. Now we'll be able to open a wormhole and warp to phase. I'm on it, General. It's time to end this. Andros won't have his way with me. Once you rendezvous with the fleet, we'll head straight into the belly of the beast. Copy that, General. Belly of the Beast. I look forward to fighting alongside you again, Samus. Godspeed. No problem. I'm pressing one. Uh oh. Where are we going now? I can only imagine. Oh. Over there, I guess? Wait a minute. Is it letting me pick? Pirate Homeworld Seed, we did that already. Logbook updated, yeah, sure. Alright, so, um. Did I miss something? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Take heed, Samus. Once you join the fleet and the one vault space is opened, there is no turning back. Yep, that's what I've heard. Wait, Please let me just see. Just prepare yourself. Yeah, we're fine. I'm as prepared as I can get, man. 100%. It doesn't get no better than this. We gotta do this now, man. So I don't really want to war back to the planet, though. I don't think I do. Like, I want to just take off and go, man. Well, I guess I have to go back to my ship. I thought I was taking the Leviathan in or something. I'd... okay. Guess I got a little confused. Well then, let's go back. Okay, guys, well, we made it back to the ship, and it's been a hell of a trip, but I think I'm going to stop the video there. I honestly thought we were going to get this in two parts, but man, this recording is at 53 minutes. Maybe this will end up being short or something, but anyway, I'm going to go in there and grab some of that roast beast, and I'll be back in here to finish this up. 
with Roast Beast in tow. Anyway, see you guys in a little bit.